You want to get a minimap in Minecraft? We're going to show you how to get Xero's minimap in 1.21.9. First things first, go here. It's the second link down below in the description. And once you're here, go ahead and scroll down and click the download Xero's minimap button to go to the official download page. Once you're here, go ahead and click on files. And then we want to find the 1.21.9 fabric version. Right here it is. Click the three dots, click download file, and the download will begin after a few seconds. While this is downloading, have a quick message from our hosting provider, Simple Game Hosting. Go to the first link in the description down below to start your very own 24-hour DDoS protected Minecraft server for you and your friends. You can easily add mods, plugins, mod packs to your server, and customize it any way that you want. Plus, there's expert live chat support there to help you out along the way. So, don't struggle to host a Minecraft server. Start your server the simple way at the first link in the description down below to break down the next YZ sus SGH. Nonetheless, we can go ahead, save this file, and we need to download one more thing. Well, actually, two more things, but one of those is probably one of the more important ones, the Fabric Mod Loader. This is what actually links Xero's minimap to Minecraft, and of course, it's linked down below. Once you're here, click Download Fabric, and then click the Download for Windows button to start downloading the installer for Windows. Then we want to go ahead and get the Fabric API. This is an API mod that is required for Xero's minimap to work. If you try to install it without this, it's not going to work at all. So, of course, link down below, click Download, and then we want to grab the 1.21.9 version of the Fabric API here. Once this download is complete, all of our downloads are complete, and we don't need to download anything else to get Xero's minimap. So go ahead, minimize your browser, and then we can go ahead and find the Fabric API and the Fabric installer, as well as most importantly, Xero's minimap in our downloads folder. Double click the Fabric installer, and then once you've done that, we're going to go ahead and make sure that we have the 1.21.9 version selected, and click install. Boom. That easy. Fabric is now successfully installed. Click OK, close out of the Fabric installer, and delete it. Now we want to go ahead and get our mods installed. We're going to open up the Minecraft launcher here, and then in the Minecraft launcher, all we've got to do is go to our installations tab up here at the top. Then we want to make sure that mod is checked and we have this fabric loader installation. Hover over it and click the folder icon and that will open up your Minecraft folder. In here you should have a mods folder, but if you don't, just go ahead and make one and then drag and drop the fabric API and Xero's minimap directly in to your mods folder. The mod's now installed. If we go ahead and jump in game using our Fabric installation, you've got to play with Fabric in order to have the mod installed and working. We will be able to see as soon as we join our server here that the minimap is active in the top right. And it's black right now. We'll go ahead and load in. There we go. And you can customize it by hitting Y on your keyboard. You can turn it on and off. You can change the position, of course. And you can also come in here and change even like the size of the overlay. All of that can be done. It's actually kind of crazy. Everything that you can change here. There we go. The size of the minimap. You can make it look north. You can turn it into a square. And you can manage waypoints. Points. This is one of the coolest features as well is we can add in a spawn waypoint here for example confirm and then now if we run away from this area we will see the spawn waypoint there and it does even persist through walls. It's also on your minimap in the top right. So now that you know how to get the minimap mod, what's the next mod you want? Let us know in the comments and enjoy this video. Be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more incredible content. We'll see you in the next one. I am out. Peace.